trick me like that. Y'all just gonna bypass, okay? Okay, okay. What's up, everybody? This is Elijah 5000 coming in hot. I just got done with a little bit of anime podcast recorded. Episode 90, which is already out, is dropped for you guys to go ahead and listen to. And then I rushed my ass home, wanted to see my lovely family, but to jump on Dragon Ball Z back run after Dragon Ball Installer. Here we are. Amazing, amazing, amazing. I've been waiting for it. Every time that there's a Dragon Ball game, I'm always like super excited. The following sub stories have been unlocked. Competitive party with friends. It is available in Cell Games episode 2 for the future. You have received early access on you. An event will automatically take place once you get to Cell Saga uh, episode 2. You receive Smiling Ultra Mega Roast. Only one. You can use item and your item. And then there was another code that I got. And the code says uh, January 17th. 2020, and I've not been able to upload it yet, so I'm hoping that the only reason is because uh, it can only be activated on uh, the 17th, so at midnight, we'll be able to go to it, and like, the audio and shit ain't even all the way up, I'm gonna turn it down just a little bit more. Because right now, as you can see, uh, if you're familiar with it, I'm streaming from uh, the PS4, which means like cutscenes and stuff might get cut out. Uh, they do that quite frequently, not to give away spoilers, or uh, th- it's for NDAs and for a lot of things. But before I continue, story recap in this world exists seven mystical orbs known as Dragon Balls. And who should obtain all seven is granted anything their heart desires. This strange tale has these dragon balls at its very heart. Um, you heard me, me and Buck will talk about this. This Sunday is the uh, video game episode. Um, again, like if you follow patreon.com forward slash the Elijah Bailey show, you get access to our personal discord, but you get access to all the things we're going to talk about uh, on the show beforehand, as well as, um, uncut, unedited versions of the show. You get ad free shows (laughs) and much more, but let's get on this journey. Mm, Go on. Four year old go (laughs) on. Dad? Dad? Mm. Mm. Saying raised on Earth. I love this. And this is cool because this is before Gohan falls off the cliff and all that other shit. This is some of the behind the scenes stuff that Akira Toriyama was saying that he added to the game that we never saw before. You came. I like to do a little image training every now and then to make sure I don't get too rusty. Time to see what I can do. Oh and you're God. just the guy to help me do that. Get his ass. Come on. Yeah! So the tutorial starts now. Oh, dude. I'm loving this. One thing I loved about Budokai when it first came out is because it looked like the show because the games that we got beforehand from Final Bow, Ultimate, all that shit, it just wasn't the same thing. Let me try to memorize this shit. Okay. Oh. Ooh, hold for special. Alright, let's give it a go. Yeah, 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 yeah
and bad guys had distinct power shots like Raditz was kind of pinkish purple but Vegeta and Piccolo's were purple blast and Akira Toriyama like that you just show that negative dynamic of each character this shit right now is nice though ready to explore this uh, I mean functional open RPG world for Dragon Ball the boy Son Goku defeated Demon King Piccolo, who plotted world domination. Five years have passed since his victory. victory. Oh, you know what would have been dope is if down in the corner of the loading screen, they used to do this on all the loading screens, you could move the analog uh, sticks or press buttons, and it would engage like a uh, capsule opening up or getting rid of all the capsules on the screen, or um, Master Roshi on Nimbus. Or not even on Nimbus, because he couldn't ride Nimbus. He uh, rode the uh, tortoise, because he tried. He gave Goku the Banshee fan, the Bancho fan, and then he needed to ride that tortoise to the mountain, because Ox King's mountain was on fire. Well, that's the shit that I like, because I open this case and close it, and then I had to stop for a second. I open it again, and I realized we don't get instruction manuals, because, as you can see, we're going through the tutorial now, but that was something we used to get. We used to get movesets for each and every character, I remember importing uh, all the Dragon Ball games in Japanese and having the, and that was shit I used to take to school and show to friends, like, oh shit, look at this. What does that say? Oh, that's his special attack. It's probably like the Kamehameha, that's like this, that's like that. So I'm excited to see what this has to offer, because this shit right here, everything that I've been seeing um, before this has been very interesting. Just because I didn't think this game would exist. And if you can do this, you can do Cowboy Bebop, you can do Trigun, you can do all these other series. <laughs> Not much longer before this planet's out. It would have been ours much sooner if you'd actually done your job, Raditz. Oh, bitch. Oh, sorry. And that's why everyone calls you Raditz the Runt. Things will be different on the next planet. <laughs> Mark my words, if you screw up again, I will kill you. Damn. Wait, I, I just remembered something. I think my little brother Kakarot was sent to a different planet. I'll bet he's still there. You have a brother? I didn't think there were any Saiyans left besides us. If he joins us, the rest of the universe will be ours in no time. The 
fact that he's your brother doesn't exactly fill me with confidence. What planet was he sent to? Uh, I think it's called Earth. I think it's called Earth. Fucking say an earther. But now that I think about it, I haven't heard anything about him taking control of it. <coughs> Damn that Kakarot, what the hell is he doing? I ain't no sleeping shit. <coughs> Attack of the Saiyans. Aw, oh, dude, this shit just captured my fucking heart right there. That's nostalgia at its fucking best. If you can bottle that up right there and sell that shit, be fucking rich. That was one of the reasons that we tuned in Dad? every week to see Dad? that little scroll and shit. To hear that. Last time on Dragon Ball Z, we left your heroes. What will happen this time? Kali Bear. Fucking phenomenal. Dad? Made my childhood, man. We better head home or mom's gonna be really mad at us. Damn, Gohan sound like a grown ass man. Dad, mom's gonna be mad. Sorry for getting a bit carried away, Gohan. I was fighting somebody super strong! Super strong? Yeah, a guy going by the name of Piccolo. Piccolo? He's gonna be your daddy, boy. He's gonna be your, your step-in daddy. Yeah, well, he used well, to be called Demon King Piccolo, and he was real bad to the bone. He might not really be your daddy. He's gonna, after I die, he's gonna he's steal you. He's the strongest guy I've ever fought in my whole and train life. You. I don't think anybody's gotten me more daddy. pumped up than him. Is a thief. I want to fight him again, so I'm hoping to get stronger and soon. I'd be afraid to fight someone like that. <laughs> you know, I bet you'd be just fine if you trained yourself up a bit. I hmm. don't think mom would like that very much. Ah, that's right. I totally forgot that Chi Chi asked us to get some ingredients for her. How could I not remember that? Oh, okay, so they start you off with introducing you on how to go about the world and do these mini games. Uh, so that's think. Cool. What all did she need again? I do like the fact oh, that... Uh, I think she wanted some fish and apples, Dad. Gohan is talking a little bit more, but this motherfucker didn't talk like this. He was like, huh? <laughs> Daddy! He was crying and asking for it. Uh, see, even me acting like that, my dogs don't like that bullshit. That's why we, we had a tough time getting my dogs through the first half of Dragon Ball because Gohan was acting like a little hoe ass. Oh, but yeah, right. He's talking his Let's ass off. Let's just see now. if we can't find us some apples around Maybe this place. Maybe this did happen within those five years. It's supposed to be four years, but five years. Okay. I'll go. I look. thought it was four years. My bad. I'm not going to try to correct the game and shit. Gohan I thought it was sure four is years, full of energy. Apparently it's five years between Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball Z. Oh shit. You know, your kid is running away from you. Uh, blasts, high dash. These are essentially the same controls. Dismount, ride, vehicle. Huh. You can find a variety of items. Simply approach an item and with automatic and it will do automatic click and you will have to press the button. Okay. Don't get too excited and trip over your own feet. Now, where did that son of mine run off? Yeah. to say he couldn't have gone that far. Yeah. God, I love this. Yeah. I do think yeah. it's one of the biggest flaws. Over here. Hey, With. it looks like you found an apple tree. With the uh, sh shonen type of. Uh, Face this exclamation off. point. Safe to say he couldn't have gone that far. The fuck did go on go? <laughs> Where did that but son of mine run off? Basically, the product Safe to of say he couldn't have gone that far. Gohan should be training himself like Goku did. <laughs> but Goku yeah. trained himself like that just because Grandpa Gohan got murdered. Shit is just fucking ridiculous. Let's 
try to find one more. What do you say? <laughs> Leave it to me. Gohan looks like he's having a blast. <laughs> hey now, don't go wandering too far. God, look at that. This is just fucking amazing. Like, you have the fucking dinosaurs in this world just flying their wings, and I'm using my Arctic Five headsets, and uh, it just sounds phenomenal to hear their wings and hear the fucking air and shit. Oh yeah, we've got plenty of apples now. Thanks for finding these, Gohan. <laughs> oh, I'm kind of tired now, though. I get it, and I don't blame you. Hang in there, I got an idea. We'll catch some fish and then head straight home. Okay. But first, we need to find a spot to fish. Okay, don't walk too fast. You got it. Try to keep up, though. Yeah, fuck you, people, me, boy. You lazy ass. Bookworm, book reading ass. Oh, boy. Damn, go on. Come on, man. Yeah. Huh? What's wrong, Gohan? Man, you get tired pretty easy, don't you? <laughs> I guess I can carry you if you want. Hooray! Hey, you little bitch. Hello! <laughs> Yay! Look how high I am! Hey, you perked right up. Are you I trying to your trick your old man? <laughs> You're one spoiled kid, you know that? Damn, this is not happy. So, oh, what do you want to be when you grow up? Hmm. Okay. Um, I want to become Thought. a great scholar. Just through my mind. You what? see this shit right here? You're a weird Sword one, of Omen. <laughs> Give me sight beyond sight. Thundercats game. I can feel it. I don't really know how good that would be. But well, I definitely can't help you with dope, your studies though. or anything like that. But if you're ever looking to toughen up, I'm your man. Uh, fighting is too scary for me. Come to think of it, this is your first time fishing, isn't it? Yep, it is. All right. Then let me show you how I used to do it back when I was your age. It'll be fun. I'm pretty sure on, there's a good spot somewhere right around this place. Daddy, it did my ass. I'm done. We should be able to catch something here. All right. Let's get started. But what are we going to fish with? We don't have any rods. <laughs> Nobody said anything about a rod, did they? <laughs> Who needs one of those pesky things when you've got a tail? M my, my tail? Yep. By dipping your tail in the water, you can feel the fish moving around. Pretty neat, huh? It's really easy once you get the hang of it. I mean, I haven't done it in a while since I don't have a tail anymore. But when I told my friend Bulma about it, she actually made me a makeshift tail to fish with. <laughs> Can you believe it? <laughs> nice! Oh, okay. That's how they explain this weird ass tail. So what do you say? Let's catch but us how, some fish! How would he feel it though? And how is it, how is it stuck on his body? So many questions. Hope I can catch something. Yeah, you probably won't go on. This is gonna be weird as fuck. <laughs> Let's suck it up his ass. 
that's what I want. Oh shit, what happens? I have to do what Chi Chi asked me to do first. No point going that way. What? What the hell? Alright! How's about to catch this some bitch? I gotta shake my ass again. That's all Goku's doing is twerking right now. You guys know that, right? I never fucking thought the day would come where the man was working. Yeah. Oh shit. Yeah. I did it too. That's not a bad yeah. little mini game. That seems about right. Like the animation afterwards. <laughs> you got them, Dad. Yeah. Now, what the fuck going on? I bet Chi Chi will flip when she sees this one. Man. All this fishing is really working up an appetite, you know what I mean? Let's eat some of these fish. I mean, we've got plenty. <laughs> yeah, uh, I'm a little hungry too. <laughs> Let's roast our catch over the fire. What do you say? I'm hungry for some grilled fish. Come on, hurry your ass, go home. Okay, time to grill up some fish. Man, I'm stuffed. Is there anything better, Belly? Oh, I think I ate too much, though. Well, if you want to be as big as your dad, you're gonna have to eat a lot of this stuff. <laughs> right. <laughs> Normal kid response. <laughs> I had fun right. today, Dad. You know, I had fun today too. Thanks for your help. I'll teach you how to fish next time so we can do it together. Okay. I can't wait. Man, get the fuck out of my face. Bonding. Soul emblems, baby. Soul emblems are items that represent relationship with certain characters and can be obtained as you progress through the story. All of the soul emblems that you obtain can be viewed on the community menu. Soul emblems don't do anything by themselves, but by setting them to a community board, you can activate effects that will help you on your adventure. And I think I saw one that helped uh, Goku transform like Super Saiyan 3 and shit, so these will, the community board will be <coughs> uh, specific, I guess, to the saga. is influenced by the overall community level on the soul board as uh, you have said once the overall community level reaches a certain value the community strength will increase and you will gain access to more of its community skills which provide helpful effects on your adventure as the community's overall level is dependent on the community level the soul level set to it is also possible to lower the community's rank by adding or removing emblems soul emblems have community levels that affect the community which they are set emblems are well suited to some communities but not well suited to others setting them to certain communities will increase the maximum community level increased provisioning will increase the community's level giving gifts from the community menu on the soul emblem screen increases proficiency in a community different items increase different communities proficiencies and also increase friendships friendships affect how a support character will perform in battle very useful information in this community, you can activate community skills that will help you in the battle, or in battle. Build up the Z-Warrior community if you want to focus more. Alright, well, let's go. I bet 
bet you'd be pretty strong if you trained. Uh, I don't think so. Ultimate Bother Sunday. Please need some soul emblems. And uh, next one, another will activate what's called a link bonus. Activating a link bonus raises the community level and makes it easier to raise community's rank. Press that button on the community board screen to view. Uh, oh, yeah, Dad! I meant to tell you! I found this while you were fishing. I don't really know what it is, but here, you can have it. It's a Gundam. Really? Son. Gundam. Thanks, Gohan! <laughs> Secret text of the marshmallows. Give the item to the heart. Soul emblems, friendship, proficiency can both be increased by using gifts. Raising an emblem proficiency to a certain amount will increase this community level. The community that is affected will depend on the gift given. For example, the sacred text of martial arts increase, uh, item increases proficiency in the Z Warrior community. Friendship influences how characters perform. In battle. Nice. <coughs> I'm gonna use the shit out of it. Da 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 Thanks. Mom was about to be pissed, son. Oops. I have to do what Chi Chi asked me to do first. I don't need to head over there. So, should we head over there? Right, let's go ahead and go Alright. Alright. Let's go. Okay. Here goes! Flying Nimbus! Smooth as fuck. Alright. Hang and on this tight! this is gonna go right into the <laughs> opening. If this goes right into the opening. Whoa! It's a dinosaur! <laughs> <coughs> I don't know what the fuck. Bye -bye. If this doesn't go right into the opening, I'll suck a dick. This will be fucking ridiculous. <laughs> <coughs> I retract that last statement. Z orbs are spe <laughs> special items you can find on the field or win battles. I'm gonna go to bed. <clears throat> oh, this is so Fast. I've been riding this whole thing since I was just a little kid. Shit. God damn it, they know how to Only them. those with a pure heart can ride. Oh, that explains why you've got no problems ride. there. Yeah, this is fun. Something tells me we're going to be a little late. Your old mom isn't too mad. Fuck, You're making me nervous, Gohan. Yeah, I'm about to put your little ass out. Where's my house? Let me hurry up and get over here for she to be bitching again. Damn, this is so cool. Shit, and then just ran over Chi Chi, she's dead. This is cool. Hey Chi Chi, we're back! And we got food! Hi mom! You're late, Goku! It shouldn't have taken you so long to gather ingredients. Yeah, sorry about that. We did some training too. You're supposed to introduce Gohan to Master Roshi and the others today. Wait, that's today? Of course! <sighs> Sorry about that. I promise I'll remember next time. Forget it. What are you waiting for? Get in here! I need to get cooking right away! Damn. 
funny. You can't give you a kiss, a hug. You can't say, hey, you look sexy today. Thank you for going out into the woods and doing whatever it is that you do to get the food that you got. GG. Come on now. Better make a motherfucking full course because you don't have that Goku, where do you think you're going? I'm not done yet, so just sit tight. Now then, I'll just take these ingredients and whip you up something tasty. Make a dish, make a full course meal for this man. Oh, y'all ain't got like that. Let's just make a dish. Select boiled fish. Boiled tofu. I'm going to see Master Roshi, my old master. His place is surrounded by the sea. It's loads of fun. Oh, yeah. I can't wait, Dad. Uh, I could really go for some food right about now. Krillin used in our training. Me and him had to hunt this thing down. Krillin beat me then, but only because he cheated. I had to go hungry that night. <laughs> yeah, he's mad as fuck. Goku, where do you think? Right. Dig in whenever you're hungry. Thanks, TG. Your stuff's the best. Really gets the blood pumping and the muscles moving. Right, Gohan? Yeah. Later, Chi-Chi. We're off to see Master Roshi. Wait a second. Are you forgetting something, Goku? I thought you had something for Gohan. Oh, yeah, that's right. Whoa, what a neat little ball. That little ball on top there? It's a Dragon Ball. I got it from my grandpa after he died. But that's not all you got from him. You were also named after him. Really? Oh my, Gohan looks so handsome. It'll be like he's watching over you whenever you wear that hat. So take real good care of it, okay, Gohan? Watching over me when I get yeah, my ass I will. Thanks, Mom. Thanks, Dad. 
All right, well, we're well, leaving for real this time. Up my ass. Goku, don't let anything happen to our little Gohan. And Gohan, be on your best behavior. I will, Mom. Bye. I want you both home by supper. You got it? Chi Chi, give me something else to do. <sighs> Protecting Gohan is going to be a little bit difficult this time. My brother's like two of me right now. Uh, what's up, Vader? Son Goku, the strongest fighter in the world, leads a happy life at home with his new family, having been blessed with a child. Goku makes his way to Kame House, where he intends to introduce his son to his teacher, Molten Roshi. It's said there are seven mystical orbs capable of granting any wish when brought together. With them, anything the heart desires can be attained, whether unfathomable riches or absolute power. These mysterious wish-granting orbs are known as the Dragon Balls. And it's around these Dragon Balls that this extraordinary story unfolds, with new challenges and adventures awaiting Goku and his friends at every turn. Hey, Dad? What's Master Roshi like? Well, he looks like a feeble old geezer, but he's super strong. Really? Though, it's a real shame he's kind of a massive pervert. Yeah, he was my rival at the time, but now he's my best friend. Is Krillin strong, just like you? Yeah, seriously. Out of all the guys I know, he's definitely up there. There's also a woman I know named Bulma. See, she was looking for the Dragon Balls when she ran into me, and we ended up going on adventures together. If we hadn't done that, I probably wouldn't have met Master Roshi and the others. I see. Not too much longer until Master Roshi's place. I wonder what everyone's been up to. Oh, and who's this little guy? Meet my son. What? what? Your, your son? Yeah. Wild, huh? Nice to meet you. Oh, uh, nice to meet you too. His name is Gohan. Gohan? Oh, so you named him after your grandpa, huh? Yeah. Suits him, don't you think? Goku, have you been training lately? Well, not as much as I want to. Chi Chi gets pretty angry if I train too much, you know what I'm saying? What the fuck? I can't even go into the next part after what I just heard. Y'all heard that too. Wait, so I'm gonna read that shit back. Well, not as much as I want to. Chi Chi gets pretty angry if I train too much. You know what I'm saying? When the fuck? When in the fuck has Goku ever talked like that? And not only that, Sean Shimmel put a, you know what I'm saying on it? This motherfucker slang the shit out of Goku. Goku is a Japanese motherfucker. He ain't saying. Know what I'm saying? Like that. What the fuck is this shit? What in the fuck? Right. Yeah, I haven't trained myself either. That shit stunned the fuck out of me. With Piccolo taken care of, things have been pretty quiet. You know what I'm saying? Hey, you two. What are you talking about? Your mama. Uh, mama. Uh, uh, nothing really. Hmm. I could have sworn you two were talking about how you've both been slacking off on your training. <sighs> Guess there's no fooling you, is there, Master Roshi? It would seem you've both forgotten that training is a daily activity, not something you do only on special occasions. Damn. You should be moving, learning, playing, eating, and resting every day. That's the way of the turtle school. 
Uh, okay, that shit didn't happen. I'm glad that they uh, said that now, but that's from Dragon Ball Super. That was the message he was giving Goku and him because the motherfucker knew he was dying. So it's something he knew he, he never told him. The fuck are they doing with this game? I can't argue with you there. Now, to make sure you two never forget your daily training, I've got a little challenge for oh, you. Oh, it was just a setup for mini game. And people that don't think about it, like, oh, so that's why he said it in Dragon Ball Super. Go back and watch this. Come report shit back to me watch. once you've finished your training. Yes, sir, Master Roshi. Yes, sir, Master Roshi. Now, I do like the fact that you're back to, get to, back to my to usual them. enjoyment. <laughs> They're creepy. Lieutenant Roshi, the adult community leader. Oh, shit. Yes. Uh, um. Hey. <laughs> Greetings. Hey. Huh? This is fucking nice. Yes. Greetings. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, I'll look outside for your smut book. Alright, what book. should I do now? Oh, is this it, Master Roshi? <laughs> I gotta take care of some stuff first. Oops, went a little too far. Can't get sidetracked now. Take care of some stuff first. What's up? <laughs> hmm. 
What's this? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, here we go. Take care of some stuff first. So, he's got your looks, but does he have your power? I'm betting that he's pretty strong if I had to guess. But I can't be sure since Chi Chi won't let me train him to find out one way or the other. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> yep. Looks like that did the trick.
gotta take care of some stuff first. So, he's got your look. I'm betting that he's pretty strong if I had to guess. But I can't be sure since Chi Chi won't let me train him to find out one way or the other. Son Goku, the strongest fighter in the world, leads a happy life at home with his family, having been blessed with a child. It's the same message again. Goku makes his way to Kame House, where he intends to introduce his son to his teacher, Muten Roshi, or Master Roshi. Blah, blah, blah. Now that just happened. Now comes the ass-whooping of his life from his older brother, a farmer. <laughs> Say, what the fuck is that? <laughs> what is it? It ain't no meteor. Just as I thought, the creatures on this planet are still alive. Kakarot's failed us. Uh, who or what are you? A power level of only five? What trash. Uh, stay back! Blah! Is this the best this planet can muster? Well, now, here's a large power reading. Distance 4880. Kakarot? <laughs> what in the world could that have been? Never felt a power like this. Hmm. Not sure what this is. This could be fun. Where the hell could he be? I'll make quick work of you.
anything I've ever felt before. That looks like a well-designed bridge. Well now, this could be fun. I'll make quick work of you. I'll make quick work of you. Is that a, oh, steel bridge? This could be fun. I'll make quick work of you.
This thing is incredible. Whoa, this power is amazing. <laughs> Looks like someone wants to die. Well now, this could be fun. Is that some sort of cave? I'll make quick work of you. This could be fun. I'll make quick work of you. This'll end it! Now, this could be fun. I'm ready whenever you are. Let's do this. This will end it. This could be fun.
This could be fun. like someone wants to die. Waterfall. Wasn't Kakarot after all? Who the hell are you? I don't have time to waste with you. Wait a minute. This is a Namekian, isn't it? What the hell is a Namekian doing on this planet? If that's true, then what are you even doing here? You got a death wish? <laughs> You've got spunk. I like that. Hmm. A power level of 322, huh? You're definitely stronger than the others. But you wouldn't even be a warm-up for me. You're making a mistake in underestimating me. Let's see if you can make this fun for me.
Is it my turn now? Time to show you what real power looks like. <laughs> I'm getting another large power reading. Where is it going? Well, if it isn't Kakarot, you've grown. You look just like our old man. What? Tell me, Kakarot, what is this? You were supposed to exterminate all life on this planet. What have you been doing all this time?
are you? And who's Kakarot? Should I know who that is? You've got to be kidding me. You don't remember. Fine then, allow me to refresh your memory. You're not from this filthy planet. You were born on planet Vegeta. You're a member of the proud and mighty warrior race, the Saiyans. And that's not all. I'm your older brother, Raditz. You're lying! That can't be true! Long ago, you were sent to this pathetic planet to rid it of all life! We Saiyans search the universe for habitable planets and wipe out all who live there. so that we can sell those planets to the highest bidder. We snot-nosed brats like you are sent to low-level planets, like this. And fortunately, it looks like this one's got a moon. <laughs> if this guy's telling the truth, then these Saiyans are some real bad dudes. Wait, what about the moon? What does that have to do with anything? Don't play dumb with me. We Saiyans release our true power whenever there's a full moon. Even chumps like you should know that. Eh? I don't know what you're talking about. You know, I think Krillin's right. You guys are the worst. My name's Son Goku and I'm from Earth. Take your lies and get out of here. <laughs> well, I couldn't even if I wanted to. Because Planet Vegeta was blown to smithereens by a meteor. Almost all of our brethren have been turned to space dust now. Uh. Including me and you. There are only four Saiyans left. Just the other day, we found a planet that should fetch us a high price. The three of us were going to have a hell of a time trying to overtake it. And that's when I remembered you. Kakarot. The planet is as good as ours if you join. Come on, Kakarot! Think of the fun we'll have! Isn't your Saiyan blood boiling with excitement? Just shut up! If you think I'm joining you, then you're dumber than you look! Fine. Be that way. That little runt with the tail behind you is your kid, right? I guess I'll just take him instead. Huh? Come any closer and I'll knock you sky high! Back off! <laughs> oh yeah? Well, go ahead if you think you can. Gohan's not going anywhere with you!
make sure to take good care of the boy. If you want him back, then you better do as your big brother said. Don't even think about trying to be a hero. <laughs> no! No! Palma, you still got that dragon radar? Oh, I get it! That decoration on Gohan's hat was a dragon ball! All right, I'm off! It's now or never! You're as good as dead on your own. Neither of us has what it takes to face him head on. At least if we tried on our own. But together, if we were to team up, we just might be able to take him down. Yeah, you're probably right. But can I really trust you? What's your angle in all this? Don't get the wrong idea. It isn't that I care in the slightest about your little kid or the Earth. That fool is the only thing standing between me and world domination. The moment he and his cronies are out of the picture. I finally rid myself of you. Then the world will be mine for the taking. You're crazy if you think I'm about to let that happen. But for now, I guess we gotta join forces. I guess there's really no getting around that. Precisely. Give me a break. Thank you! <sighs> hey! Yeah! Flying them? that Raditz clown was going on about? No, none of it rings a bell. It's crazy. I had no idea I had an older brother either. <laughs> I was hoping to milk some useful information out of you for our fight.
confronts a man claiming to be Goku's brother and a member of a warrior race known as <sighs> the Saiyans promptly defeat Goku and makes off with Gohan. Piccolo then arrives and the two agree to team up. His tail's probably his weak point. If we can squeeze his tail, he should be vulnerable. That's what happened whenever mine got grabbed. I'll be playing again um, tomorrow and the day after that. Uh, I'll be streaming from both Twitch and YouTube again. That's Elijah 5000. Twitch.tv forward slash Elijah 5000. YouTube and Elijah 5000. Let's play Elijah Bailey Show. A little bit of anime and catch AR 4 5 Fits and LP like Father and Like Daughter and the Halo's podcast. I'll catch your ass. The next broadcast.